A new library, unlike any other, is being planned for the Buenaventura Lakes area of Osceola County. BVL, we're talking to you. The project just received a several million dollar grant to move forward. But as West Street's Megan Mulatto explains, it won't have any physical books inside, just cutting edge technology. Blanca Massa is the president and CEO of a nonprofit called Twice As Good, helping those with autism and special needs enter the workforce. Uh, we always need a lot of you know, resources for them, especially when we work with adults with special needs. She says she often brings them to public libraries. Soon, she'll also be able to take them to a new 8,000 square foot tech library, offering artificial intelligence, virtual and augmented reality, as well as learning labs and facilities for three 3D printing, audio and video production. They are very sensorial, so pretty much they like when it's quiet and uh, they are a little bit more uh, advanced, I think, and about technology, so they love that. I had this idea of having it to be kind of the library of the future. Commissioner Viviana Jayner says the county was just awarded $4 million for the estimated more than $7 million project to be built in her district. We do have enough funds in our library fund to be able to complete that library. Jayner says the new library will complement the high tech direction Osceola County is going in. I thought it was important for us to continue to build um, with everything that we're trying to do in the in the county and bring in um, technological industries to build on those um, capacities and give them access to this through our public library system. She says she's been meeting with local students at a variety of schools to make sure the library has everything they'd be looking for. We really need it on Osceola because Osceola is growing so fast. We have more people, so we need more uh, resources in the community. In Osceola County, Meg Mulatto, West 2 News.